there, this is just going to be a quick unboxing video of what I bought today from Argos. So I went to Argos today to buy a vanity case and I came across this rose gold, um, pretty in pink, I don't know if that's the brand name, a large rose gold aluminium vanity case and I'm just getting, getting it out of the box now to show everybody. Way. And it's quite big. It's quite it's larger than what I thought it was gonna be. Oh, it's really shiny. Really shiny. I don't know if you can see that there. Nice colour. two locks on it and it looks like they have little keys as well it opens out there's some compartments here at the top that all they slide across slide across there and the, yeah there's, there's some little keys there's some little keys that will Lock it up if you want to hide anything away in there. That was quite big really, so I'm just going to put all like my everyday makeup that I use in here. To keep it a bit more organised because I seem to lose quite a lot of stuff. Feels quite sturdy though. Different. Yeah, I'm quite impressed with it. It's a good big size, you can carry it, it's not too heavy. I mean, it's quite heavy, it's quite substantial, but you could carry it around if you needed, if you were a professional makeup artist and you wanted to take it to jobs with you and things like that. And then I also bought, um, this might show I hope this isn't blinding you, just a rose gold. Um, mirror that was just from asda i think it was it was five pounds from asda so i like all this new rose gold that's in right so i'm in the middle of putting all my makeup into this new this new um, beauty box I got from Argos, which I unboxed for you. And it's not going to plan really. Because I've discovered, even though I thought it was really big and had loads of sections, it doesn't work out for really, if you've got loads of makeup. So what I'm doing is I'm just putting like all the things in that I reach for on a, on a daily basis that I'm using a lot and I'll just have to sort of rotate it of other things that I pick up and want to use. So, piles in here is all my blushes that I'm probably, I'm hoping that these are the ones that I use. I've got a highlight there from the balm, some MAC ones, it's all rubbed off, I've had it for ages. Peachy Keen. Oh, Hypnus, that was a limited edition one from a long time ago. A bronzer from MAC, what's this one, Immortal Flower, see I don't use that, so that'll probably come out of there, and this is, what's this, Hush, the highlight from Hush, years ago everyone on YouTube used to have that and that's why I bought it, I didn't really like it, so some of these things will get taken out because there's too many things in there, and this messy bit, there's like primers, Urban Decay Primer Potion, the Too Faced one, Shadow Insurance, eyebrow things, like this 
um, benefit one. That wonder brow that they all advertise is, I don't like it. I'll just put it in there for in case I need it. I like these ones. These are from um, NYX or NYX or however you're supposed to say it. They're like eyebrow gel. I've got a few different colours of them. I don't use them as much now because I have my eyebrows microbladed. Some mascaras that I use a lot, the Too Faced one. Uh, another NYX one. Um, I've got those to put in there as well. I use this new one's quite nice from um, L'Oreal Baby Doll, Miss Baby Doll, and the Miss Manga one. I like that one. Uh, and then in here is like every well, I wanted this to be like the face bit. So this is the foundation that I use mostly, um, Urban Decay All Nighter, and I've got some uh, concealers. Benefit Arrays Paste, I like that one. A MAC Studio Finish. Uh, like an eye, um, there's an eye cream thing there. Contour thing from Maybelline. I've just shoved a few um, eyeshadow, eyeshadow palettes in here. I've got way more than that. But I just thought I'd put a couple in that I use a lot. I'll probably include the... Um, I'll put the Too Faced Chocolate Bar palettes in here as well because I use those all the time. The face powder from L'Oreal, um, Urban Decay Primer. So over here, I put the lip things, all the lipsticks in there, um, and all the lip creams and lip pencils shoved in that far one. I'm not sure if it looks a bit too big of this on the cabinet that I was supposed to be putting it on. But put it there anyway for now. It might not stay there. It looks okay. That's just my video for the day, just showing you what I bought from um, Argos and Asda. Thanks for watching. Bye!